from WMAR 2 News, Maryland's most accurate forecast. As we roll into what I have dubbed on Facebook as candy corn season, temperatures are going to get a little bit cooler. We should be at about 51 degrees at, on October 1st for a morning low. That's going to gradually drop, and I think by the end of the month, we should be needing a light jacket every day. As far as the afternoon highs, they'll start off in the low 70s, which is where we'll be tomorrow, but the numbers will get cooler there, and we're only going to start to warm to about 62 based off of the last 100 years. Averages rainfall should pick up over three inches for the month. I know lots of folks are looking for some snow. We shouldn't get any snow, although a couple years ago we picked up almost two and a half inches of snow in the month of October. So we're getting close to that time of year if you're looking for snow. No snow though, but we are tracking a cold front that is going to be sliding through our area as we head through tomorrow morning. That's going to bring, uh, or actually through your Thursday night into Friday morning. That's going to bring the chance of some showers as that starts to shift on out towards the east. We'll eventually have some clearing. Uh, I do think that we're going to have high pressure building up behind that, and that's going to lead to lots of dry time for the weekend. As far as tomorrow's concern, we're going to wake up in the low 50s. Good mix of sun and clouds after those showers start to fade. As we head into the afternoon here, we are looking at temperatures that are warming into the low to mid 60s. And then as we head into the afternoon, the daytime high climbs to 73. I I think I have a little bit of a snafu here with the graphics because of our time change uh, coming on a little bit late tonight because of the game. So the dates are going to be off a little bit, but the high for tomorrow will be 73 degrees and these are actually your evening temperatures for your Thursday. Um, so we are expecting some cooler air here. So I'm going to fast forward real quick. I want to give you guys a look at the seven day forecast where of course your weekend is in view. Keep in mind my days have shifted a little bit. So your high for your Thursday will be at 66 degrees, 65 degrees for your Friday rain chance comes in late Thursday night into Friday morning and then we're looking sunny as we head into the weekend. That rain chance trickles back into the forecast as we head back toward the beginning of next week. Highs warming into the low to mid 70s as we head through your weekend. I do want to show you the tropics one more time. We things have been on a quieter note as of late. We are watching this uh, tropical wave develop out here. It is firing up a little bit. Lots of rain activity as far as development. There's about a 20% chance that this become could become a tropical depression over the next couple of days. We're going to be watching it as it moves into the Caribbean. It will be interacting with a stationary front. Of course, we'll keep you up late not only online, but also in studio.